There is good news and bad news when it comes to teenagers and smoking. Fewer teens are smoking cigarettes, but an alarming number are vaping with e-cigarettes. In fact, a new survey from the Centers for Disease Control finds e-cigarette use among youth tripled in one year from 2013 to 2014. Ryan Sheehan from the Tobacco Free Columbia Dane County Coalition is with us. Welcome to Live at Five, Ryan. Hi, Ryan. Thanks for having me, guys. So what do you think is responsible for that dramatic increase? Are teenagers under the impression that e-cigarettes are safer than real cigarettes, and are they? That could be the case. Uh, one of the reasons, I think, is that uh, the FDA has no regulations on e-cigarettes, and so um, there, are, there are no restrictions on the flavoring within e-cigarettes where they can be advertised. And so I think uh, youth are getting the impression that um, they may be safer than regular cigarettes when you are able to advertise anywhere and everywhere and have thousands of flavors like berry and bubblegum, I think youth are really attracted to that uh, sort of thing. And your advertises, well, you know, it's, it's just vapor, but there's chemicals in that byproduct. Yeah, it's really not uh, just vapor. You know, the, uh, the term vapor really is sort of implies just a, a harmless uh, water sort of vapor. It's really an aerosol that has ultrafine particles, some heavy metals, uh, there may be uh, some formaldehyde in there. That all depends on how how hot uh, the electronic battery burns when you use the e-cigarette. The survey also found an alarming number of middle school students are actually vaping as well. That's, that's a startling statistic. Yeah, I mean, that's uh, actually you know, very uh, scary to think about. Um, nicotine has a dramatic impact on the adolescent brain, and so middle school youth and even high school youth uh, brains are still developing, and so nicotine, nicotine can change that. And so what is the coalition's message to parents? Just be aware of what your youth are using. You know, obviously, uh, these e-cigarettes are unregulated. Um, make sure, I also like to say to uh, those that are selling, uh, selling e-cigarettes that you should be checking for IDs for under the age of 18. All right, well, parents should be vigilant and keep an eye out. It's a, an alarming trend, to say the least. Ryan, thanks for being with us today. On Thank you so Five. much, Ryan. Thank you so much. Well, coming up, a special call for action segment. Adam Schrager is along with tips on how to protect your identity. It is getting harder every day.